You can now keep track of your checkout history using your account on your Shelton State Community College OPAC. To do that, get to the online public access catalog. And then up here, you'll have an option to sign in. I've already signed in to save us time, but if you click sign in, it's going to ask you for your My Shelton usernames and credentials. Then you can go to My Account. It's going to give you an option to go to Borrowing History. That's the fourth option down. This says you have not enabled borrowing history. Enable borrowing history in your profile and you can just click on profile. Use the slider to enable your borrowing history. Changes are saved. And from here on out, you'll be able to see not only your checkouts and your requests or holds, your search activity, but also your borrowing history. If you no longer want us to keep track of your borrowing history for you, you can go to Profile and turn off your borrowing history. Just so you know, this will remove all of your borrowing history from, well, you can't turn it on and see what has happened in the past. Also, if your borrowing history is on, staff cannot see it. And if your account is clear at the end of the semester, we do delete everything on the account, including the borrowing history. So even though this says that your borrowing history will be kept for a year, it will actually only be kept for the semester.